is counterplay to Aura Lucario. You don't have to play, you know, with your sphincter tight or anything like that. <laughs> <laughs> you can still just out button them if you have if you have the cojones for it. You know what I mean? Just stop putting images into my head, man. Okay. Well. <laughs> Kamui actually dropping Bayonetta for Corrin, uh, liking how she plays more. Living up to the name. Yeah. <laughs> uh, di didn't like the fact that Bayonetta made things too easy. So instead, <laughs> I'm s I swear to God, I'm not even making that up. He feels more comfortable with Corrin as yeah. a character. And like the transition from Bayonetta to Corrin for this man hasn't really been too much of a detriment to his play. He's been still getting top 8 at almost every event he's been attending, at least monthly-wise. And I, then... Yeah. Like, because like a lot of players who drop their main and then pick up a new character, they don't do as well. But he still he got second at a monthly tournament in Columbus and then top eight at a couple at, of things. Seventh at cost. Yep. So we'll see how he does today. Definitely slated to make it out of pools, but these pools are so stacked, man. I'm, I'm glad I didn't enter. Let's be honest. I wouldn't have. Made, I would have gone like one and two. Yeah, I wouldn't. <laughs> have made it out. I wouldn't have made it out for sure. I probably would have won maybe one match. It, it might have been one of my first tournaments I've ever gone zero and two. You going even going 0 and 2 isn't even that big of a thing in this man in this tournament, man. There's some serious talent out here, and we have Kamui building up about twice as much damage right now. Lucario is sitting at about one times aura and slowly building, right about 1.02 aura. That almost killed. Yeah, uh, sweet spot pin. Fortunately, Lucario not the best at getting up. Doesn't have much, but just let me back, please. Doesn't want to up be back on stage because of all that lag. Another thing that's really that really is bad about Lucario's recover recovery is that he can bonk off the stage. Yeah, that's that's so that's so unfortunate. That actually might be it. Yeah. Wow. That was <laughs> I saw Kamui's face like, what? Um, but yeah. I can't believe that worked. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, there was no spark, so it was definitely DI base. But like, who knows what the DI? He was definitely trying to get out of it. It's hard to DI because the Aura Sphere, you want to SDI out of it, but then you get hit with the up smash and you don't DI that right. It's just a mess. So finally, That'll be enough. Yeah, Lucario dying. Actually, Lucario's Aura being reset now because of even stocks. So we're sitting at about 60% power for Lucario right now. Little little baby Aura Spheres. Or Aura Pebbles. <laughs> aura, aura Pebbles. Aura okay, Pebble. It's a good way to look aura, at it. Aura Marble. So, pretty even percents. Not that it, I don't know if talking about percents really matters right now uh, in this matchup. I can't wait for him for Kamui to counter something that Lucario does with Max Aura and just absolutely just, just break the Wii U. The only problem, the only problem with that <laughs> is that Kamui rarely uses counter. Kamui loves to air dodge out of a lot of combos. Yeah, the last thing you want to do is counter, and then you're facing down an Aura Lucario charging anything. That might actually do it. Yeah. Tried to forward air to get it back, but just a little bit too much hit stun, man. Just a little bit too much momentum. Lucario not the best at um, aerial drifting. Some characters, they, they live a little bit longer by forward airing or doing certain moves. Getting their hurtbox out of the way. DDD, he just dies faster. <laughs> really? Yeah, because oh, he inflates. Oh, that's right, because he, he yeah. inflates. So if he jumps, he's done. Trying to trying to use Luigi's side B also got, does the same thing. Yeah, we got characters like yeah, the special moves in general are pretty wonky when it comes to that. Some sort of weird momentum cancel cancel thing. So we got Lucario, blah blah blah, hitting him three times for that that solid 15 damage. Blah blah blah. Couldn't blop, have said blop, it better myself. Blah blah blah. Wood 2018. I'll be here all week, people. So well, almost as good as Poopity Scoop. Yeah, Falcon stop playing. There's no Poopity Scoop on this one unless you count like Aura Sphere. Or sphere into up smash? Is that the poopity scoop? That's the poopity scoop. All right. <laughs> All right. So, Kamui still building up damage. He's got the lead, but like, I don't know. It's Lucario, close. Lucario is getting pretty close to um, one times uh, power right now. And that aura sphere looking mighty scary. It's starting to become a real projectile. Kamui's throwing out a lot of moves, but game liking has been able to come out of that. Okay. A lot of perfect shields have been coming out from Lu from Lucario, and that's why Kamui just keeps trying to throw out moves, but Ooh, it's not working. This, these mind games, crazy, man. You notice you notice the amount of perfect shields that Lucario is throwing out. It's tremendous. Uh, didn't perfect shield that. Almost dying to that one. 
I, he waited, but it still wasn't enough. Almost dying again. We are now at about one, a little over one times aura. We're talking to like 1.2 times aura. Plus, you got that rage. Looking at like 1.35, give or take, uh, power. If I were to estimate. Oh, trying to get a grab. Another grab. Nothing's gonna I, happen. Is, is this like, is this like her up throw up air kill kill window? It's gotta be so hard to memorize kill window. Okay. Kill windows for Lucario because you have to take into account rage, aura and the opponent's percent. It's probably one of the hardest 50-50s to actually land in the game. I feel like you just go for it, and if it works, it works, you know what I mean? The only oh my god, he still clipped him with that? That's crazy. The only Lucario player that I've ever seen consistently get up throw up airs was Sue. Yeah, and he probably lapped that out for days on end. Still getting clipped with those ZFSs, man. That's unfortunate. I mean, if it doesn't lead in any kill, I guess it's just more aura for him. Uh, back air's gonna start becoming safe on shield here in just a sec. Back air's already scary. Yeah, and uh, Aura Sphere is big enough. Aura's that, back air is just a little bit bigger, despite yeah. Lucario's being stronger. That might do it. Nope, going for back throw instead. He didn't think he was going to do it. Yeah, fair enough. You don't want to steal that. You want to kill right it. now, yeah. Oh, oh, Lucario is a heavy boy. We keep forgetting he's uh, slightly heavier than Mario, so he's not going to be dying to that yet. And Aura Sphere is now big enough that it will cover pretty much every ledge option. You want to you kill Lucario now. Uh, that's it, yeah. That'll do it. Exactly, like I said. It's, it's so good that she has pin, that she can poke a character like Lucario and get him with a kill option without having to get too close to him. If Lucario doesn't have any aura charged, or any aura spirit charged, she's not going to really get punished for that. That's where a lot of characters have a downfall against Lucario is because they don't have something like pin yeah, to they keep they themselves have, away. They have to scramble, which is like not what you want to do against Lucario, but Lucario actually has extra aura right now. Stock uh, One stock down. We're looking at pretty much, imagine he's like at 80% right now, and that's what we're looking at right now. Kamui's sitting very comfortably. Doesn't yeah, because really even, even if he takes a hit, he's got a stock to work with. After you lose a stock and you're sitting at a, against a, a Rage or a Lucario, that's when you have to start sweating. That is the scary part. Oh my goodness. All right, nice coverage there with the Nair. Boom! All right, not getting the grab. Still getting some damage, though. All right, try to go for the down air. Probably a stage spike or just a straight-up kill, but uh, getting sorted. I keep forgetting Korn's uh, ledge grab is like... Ah, ah. Oh, I don't even no. know what happened. That's unfortunate, man. I guess he just lost his jump. Yep. I mean, well, he, Luca 